Hi, I'm Tammy. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, it's so good to have you. I am in town today running a few errands, and I wanted to pop into two of the local antique stores and see if they have anything that just needs to come home with me today. So come along with me and stick to the end of the video and we'll see how I style any of the things that I hopefully find. I'm at Nam's Antiques in Hobbs, New Mexico and as soon as I walked in, this bucket caught my eye. I love that little candle stand table and duck decoys have been kind of on my list of things to keep my eye out for. He's missing an eye, but that just gives him character. These are some great copper pieces. I love this one with the long wrought iron handle. Oh my goodness, this is a super nice copper boiler. I have been seeing these used by people to hold firewood sitting beside the fireplace, but this one just looks way too nice to use for a purpose like that. This mirror was tucked in back in the corner of this booth and somehow it caught my eye and I moved some stuff and got it out and I just love it. I would call this an old Venetian style mirror. It's heavily damaged, but that does not bother me. Now I'm at the second antique store called Key Pieces and it's also in Hobbs, New Mexico. And look at those rugs. What an adorable little horse. I know a little boy who would definitely want to ride this and I don't think this one would quite hold up to that anymore. trying to figure out where I could put this old trunk because I really like it. That was so pretty. This old mail sorter, oh my goodness, be still my heart. seen a butter mold so small. How cute is that?
liked these ladder back chairs, but the seats were no good in them. before, but I love the look of it. Let's see what the tag says it is. Nineteen hundreds McCaskey Accounts Register. Well, that was fun. Now here's my haul. been wanting to give our den a refresh and just so happens most everything or actually probably everything that I got today is gonna go in here in the den or what we lovingly refer to as the little house. I think the black shelf is gonna be just perfect above the TV. husband Chris always says I don't know how you do all this stuff when I'm not here but when I'm here you always need me to help you <laughs> he's not too fond of being in my videos and I usually tell him I'll try to cut you out but his role is just too important so he has to stay this time one of my screws. drive him crazy the way I hang things. I'm like, here, hold this. And he's like, don't you need a pencil to make a mark? I'm like, nope, I think it should go about right here. Perfect. Now for decorating it. I'm adding the little brown 
some jug that I bought at the antique store today and a pewter tankard that I ordered a little while back and the basket that I got today. It didn't look quite right to me that way so I switched around the jug and the tankard and now I like it. picture that I got today on the plate rack with all of my ironstone even though this plate rack is about to get a new look as I'm trying to collect enough pewter to replace all of it. I decided to replace a larger mirror that I had hanging in this spot with the mirror that I got at the antique store today. And I recently moved this cabinet in here from the laundry room and the duck looks just perfect sitting on top of it. for joining me today if you liked this video be sure and press the like button and subscribe and i will see you here for the next one